Hey guys, so I was going to do a unboxing, but then time has passed and I used some of the things in the box and it was just pointless to do an unboxing. But I did an order with Brandless. If you've never heard of what Brandless is, they're an online retailer. I will insert every information down below for you guys. Everything's basically $3. Organic. So if you are somebody who likes to eat organic and it's hard to find things, you could get an order right online, get it sent to your house. It's super easy. They do everything from toiletry to food to skincare to pet stuff. Um, it's really awesome. And I also am going to compare prices with Aldi's. Um, so anything that I could find that is similar, obviously I'm going to do the organic versions of things. And if they do not carry organic at Aldi, I will give you the regular um, item to see which is a better deal um yeah so i'm gonna show you what i got from brandless and then i will insert screen um grabs of aldi because i did not actually purchase stuff from aldi because it's kind of redundant to buy the same thing twice but i'm gonna show you what i got and we'll see first thing i got was their honey it's organic true sourced gluten-free brandless <laughs> um and it is eight ounces the next thing I got was this extra virgin olive oil, organic, cold press, no preservatives, product of Italy, and it says brandless and everything, 8.5 fluid ounces, and um, yeah. The next thing I got was the agave nectar, and this is 11.75 ounces, organic, gluten-free, grown in Mexico, vegan. The next thing I bought was creamy peanut butter, organic, um... Where is the size? Oh, 12 ounces. The next thing I got was roasted garlic pasta sauce. This was 24 ounces. And each of these items were $3 each. And this was, what, 24 ounces. So the next thing I bought was virgin coconut oil. Um, this is 10 fluid ounces. This is organic, unrefined, cold pressed. Um, I got two of these butternut squashes, soups for $3. So organic, vegan, no artificial flavors. You can read what it says. It's 11.5 ounces for each one of these. And I got two of these for $3. The next thing I got was organic ketchup, 20 fluid ounces. Um, I got blue corn tortilla chips, organic, gluten-free, 100% whole grain corn. I got two of those for $3. And they are, what's the ounces on these guys? eight ounces. So I got two eight ounce packs for $3. The next thing I got for $3 was this dark roast, dark roast single serve coffee. And then you get six pods. I like dark roast coffee. So I wanted to try them out. Then I got two of the cold brew coffee bags. Um, I don't remember if these were two for three. I will definitely put that on the screen if it is. Um, organic fair trade. I wanted to try them out. Um, I like dark roast and I like dark roast iced coffee. So I'm super excited to try that. I also got these, um, two of these for $3. This is the pasta that I picked out. This is a 16 ounce pack. So two 16 ounce packs for $3. And yeah, that's all I got from Brandless. So I will go ahead and you'll see all the stuff compared to Aldi. And then I'll discuss which one I think is better. All right, guys, so with everything said and done, I kind of went over everything, and I have my winners and losers for Aldi versus Brandless. Um, I will show you screen grabs of both my carts. There are some things that I bought at Brandless that I just don't have at Aldi's, um, like the organic toilet paper. I don't really have an option for organic toilet paper, but I did compare the four-pack, which is bigger in roll size, um, and it was... Uh, you'll see the price. I'll show it to you guys. But, um, so we have kind of like, it all just depends on if you feel like getting your stuff instantly. Cause Instacart with Aldi is within two hours. You can either get it delivered to you or picked up, but you also got to remember that you do pay some fees with, as with Brandless, you pay for shipping. So, um, it just all depends on where you feel like shopping. I'm going to just go through a list. It's no particular order than what I showed you, but it's the tortilla chips at Aldi's, um, Brandless wins this. So you get two packs. 
um, eight ounces, you can get, um, basically you're saving $1.18 with brandless versus Aldi's. I do, will say though, getting your tortilla chips delivered to you in a box, they weren't the best quality, um, broken up wise. So just keep that in mind. Certain things, it did pack everything nicely. The olive oil is wrapped in bubble wrap, but, um, the chips were kind of just like stuffed in the box. So I was kind of annoyed by that. The coconut oil, Aldi wins this. You're saving 20 cents per ounce. Um, you just get more for just a little bit more dollars. So in the long run, you're saving more in the ounce wise. Um, the ketchup, you're definitely winning with brandless. Um, you're saving 78 cents. Um, I think it was two for three at brandless and it's a dollar 89, I think at Aldi. So you're you're saving. It's not much. It all depends on which you prefer. Um, the honey, all these wins, by far, you're getting a bigger package for less money. Um, they're both organic. The agave, brandless wins. You're saving 29 cents. Not by much, but um, same amount of ounces, I, I believe. Hold on. Yeah, same amount of ounces, and it's just... 29 cents more at Aldi's. The olive oil, all these wins, you're getting double, almost double your amount for just a little bit more money, I believe. So in the long run, you're saving more money with Aldi um, for the ounce, for the size. The pasta, one pasta, brandless one pasta, you were saving a lot. Um, Aldi's pasta didn't really have an organic option in the same type. They have um, spaghetti but I ordered the Fusali, Fusali, this one from Brandless. So the option compared to that is also gluten-free. Um, gluten-free at all these is a little bit higher price. So it is gluten-free slash organic. And with that, um, you're saving like $3 um, versus the Brandless. So Brandless wins the pasta. Um, the soup, they did not have a butternut squash soup at Aldi's, but they have a couple organic options, tomato, lentil, um, there was one other chicken noodle. You are saving with Aldi because you get a bigger, um, can of soup. You're saving 55 cents per ounce, um, or per package rather, if you're doing ounces and, you know, um, the peanut butter, Aldi's wins, just a better deal. So, I mean, one, two, three, four brandless wins, and then one, two, three, four, five, six Aldi wins. Um, the pasta sauce, I think, was pretty much the same. Um, just a couple cents difference for Aldi's versus brandless. Um, Aldi's wins that one. And as far as a few other things that I picked up from brandless were some organic coffee um, bars, which I'll insert a picture of because we ate them already. I'm sorry. They don't have a um, comparable option um, at Aldi's, but they do have bars and stuff that you could eat at Aldi's. And I think buying a bigger bulk pack would be better at Aldi's, um, but these were really good. And if you wanted to try them, they were $3 for a pack, which came with two bars in each pack. Um, yeah, so I mean... You know, I really don't know that I would purchase from Brandless very often. I did have a coupon cone, cone. I did have a coupon code and I spent $15 um, on extra things other than the things that I showed you guys that I can compare between all these and Brandless. And I would say um, in the food wise, I spent $36 versus $39 at Aldi's. So it's really not that big of a difference. It all just depends on who you like, where you want to order from. Um, you do have to wait for Brandless to send you the stuff more than two hours at Instacart, or you can actually just walk into an Aldi. So it's all about convenience versus, um, what you like better. So I would definitely say try out Brandless. It is a great company. Everything was packed nice. Everything was affordable. Um, I'm going to personally keep shopping at Aldi's. I, um, convenience wise is easier for me. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry it wasn't the greatest quality because I didn't actually have the stuff from Aldi to show you. But um, yeah, until next time, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, and share. As always, appreciate it. Bye.